All right, so once you have the prep work done, the next step is we just use, you can use straight Elmer's white glue. Um, we're using this Mod, Mod Podge stuff that you uh, can get at any Hobby Lobby or even Kmart or Walmart, which is kind of nice, and, you know, a little cheaper than buying Elmer's. But we brush it on straight to give a nice thick base to everything here. So basically, you know, take that brush and you're just going to go in and you're just going to you're going to paint that edge. In this case, we're going to go right up to the foundation of of the house with my crappy brush here. Like that. You want to make it kind of even, but um you know, you don't, and you can be liberal with it, but you don't want to leave big globs or rises in it. But, you know, grass kind of levels itself out a bit. So, it's really not too much of a, won't be too much of a problem when it comes down to it. So, I'm work that into the edge of the foundation there. You guys can't see it on the camera, but I've actually carved in a little landscaping area that I only want the grass to go up to that area so I'm gonna come in and paint some of that in a little bit more uh, look a little bit more carefully here up along the house and along the front walk here a little bit get some more glue Pardon my reach while I hit these areas. And go right off the edge of the module like this. And we'll quickly go over these larger areas here. Like so. Again, right off the edge of the module. You can always sand those edges later. All right. Now, well, that's nice and tacky. Wipe that edge off. Wipe my hands off. I'll take our static grass applicator, and this is a grounding plug. So we're gonna ground that, and just drop that plug in. Yeah, let's drop it in right there for starters okay then we've got a knock grass master here and we'll turn it on um, and my guess is let's see if we can get the camera to focus here I hold this sideways initially so we don't get too much with this two millimeter grass here but you can see this is really really pretty simple when it comes down to it. Let me get this out of the way. The grass almost shoots out of this thing. Sometimes you get tilted back and then forward again. There's going to be some extra that's going to get dropping in and around. It's okay because you're going to use a vacuum cleaner to get the remainder off of here. So let me work, turn the camera so you can see this little section here. The other side of the grounding plug. You can see a whole bunch just flooded out there, it's okay. Around the ground and plug a little bit more. Make sure we've got some good coverage. Alright. So, instant grass. Now, pull that grounding plug out. Turn the machine off. Grass still kind of has a tendency to shoot out of the thing. 
Now, next step is to uh, run a vacuum over this. So it's going to get loud here for a second, but you'll see what's going to happen is we're just going to suck the extra grass up and hold the, the end of the shop vac about, I don't know, an inch or two off the surface to just make sure the grass kind of stands up a little extra. So, hang on. Our static grass is nearly finished around the house. You can see right here, this is a driveway, and what I did was on the driveway, move the camera over a little bit here, I actually uh, painted where the lines are going to go uh, for the driveway. So I had this generic car here so it gave me an idea of where the tires would be and generically where I would drop the um, where I'd have the dirt in the brown section so I'm gonna go over that with some glue later on afterwards and I'm gonna sprinkle dust uh, dirt all around that area um, and then down the center I'm gonna do some grass which is the next section so I'm gonna use a smaller brush this time and I have two small sections I'm going to do here. This one here. So we'll just go down the center with this brush. Like so. You know, probably had a few too many cups of coffee which is not helping my shaky hand here at all. Get to the edge and then I've got this little patch of grass I'm going to do here inside the walk and the landscaping which is just going to be some flowers I'm going to plant on the side of the house and um, uh, some bush material as well so uh, I just want to get our static grass in that section. So I'm going to drop the grounding plug, turn this on, and let's go to town here. The grass is a little spotty here, I'm not going to lose any sleep over it because I'm going to drop some dirt over it anyway um, to thin it out a little bit, but let me vacuum it. There you have it. Eventually, this house is going to sit right in here, something like that. And you can see we've already got grass. We'll get the dirt. The grass is already kind of growing up around the porch and around the front. So yeah, this is uh, taking shape nicely. So yeah, that's how we do static grass.